Hello Gemini, this is Renee and welcome back. I haven't did the same readings in a very long time, so I wanted to get back to that. I've been focusing on the collective. Let's get back to some signs. What's going on for Gemini? I want to be free. I feel like you have someone you're in, in your energy. This could be you, Gemini, but I feel like there's someone in your energy that you really want to be free of. I feel like there's been an ending in the recent past. You've kind of let go of somebody and you're patiently moving on. You're finally letting go. And I feel like this is something that was very hard for you to do. It was hard for you to let this person go. I've lied to you about being single. Okay. And I feel like it's a lot of truths that came out about this person. Maybe you found something out. Maybe you found that the person that you were dealing with was not being loyal to you. And maybe that they were lying about being single, that they were playing the field. They were doing other things. They were not putting you first. They had you on a back burner, right? I feel like this person made you feel at times that they were saving you for later, right? And I feel like that kind of puts you in a situation to feel very defensive, like you had to protect your energy. And you're finally able to let this person go. You finally want to be free of this energy. And I feel like you are definitely um, coming to terms with that. You're feeling a lot more calm when it comes to this person and whatever it is that they're doing in the background. I feel like you are putting more of the focus on yourself. I do feel like there's other people coming in your energy. I, I do feel like there's a really big transformation coming in for you at the moment. You're currently having a glow up, Gemini, and a lot of people are finding you attractive. A lot of people are giving you attention. I feel like that's the reason why I feel like there are other people coming into your energy. And I do sense that you are moving on with somebody during this month. Time to get out of your comfort zone. Yeah, and I do think that you are stepping out of your comfort zone. You are stepping into a new reality to where you're focused on having fun. You're focused on living your life. You're focused on moving forward. There is someone still in your energy who is watching I feel safer hiding and watching you from a distance. There is someone who is lingering in, in your energy. This is a player. There is someone who is keeping an eye on you, Gemini. Someone who maybe said that they were going to let you go, but hasn't really let you go. Praying for forgiveness. There's someone who... There's someone in your energy who wants a second chance who don't want to fully let go of the situation. I feel like maybe you creating an ending for the situation has finally made this person see exactly what they wanted. I feel like you're setting boundaries at the moment. You are putting yourself as the focus. There's someone in your energy who is afraid to let you get close. But they have never felt a connection as intense as yours. Then they've never been in Gemini energy. Because Gemini energy can be very intense. Because when, when Geminis love, they love with an intensity like no one else. They are capable of adapting to a situation so well that the love just overflows. And to be totally honest, Geminis can be pretty obsessive sometimes as well. So is this you, Gemini? Better as friends. This could be someone that told you that you were better off as friends than lovers. This is someone who told you that they weren't looking for a relationship at the time. They were not able to provide a commitment. This is someone who just stuck you in the friend zone. 
and kind of kept you there. But I feel like this is someone that you were romantic with at one time, and then it kind of broke your heart that it wasn't able to move to the next phase. I never felt a connection this intense. Definitely. I feel I feel like that's the reason why this person put you in the friend zone, Gemini, is because the intensity of your connection, the intensity of your love really overwhelmed this person. They They weren't able to accepted they weren't able to feel the level of intensity that you felt even though i feel like after you pulled away your energy gemini i feel like now this person is feeling it this person is feeling that intensity this person is missing you this person is thinking about you that's the reason why they are watching you they can't stop watching you but i Another card that just came out is, I'm not ready. Yeah, and I feel like they are they feel safer watching you at a distance at the moment because they feel like they're not ready for a love at the capacity that you love. They're not ready to feel that. I feel like this person really wants the excitement. They really feel like by falling into a relationship with you or falling into the intensity of their feelings that they will be giving up something for some reason that they'll be losing out on other things in life <laughs> this person needs to get a grip i've lied to you about being single yeah i feel i feel like there's several people in this person's energy there's several people in this person's energy. They may be dealing with more than one person. You're amazing inside and out. But this person sees that there's no one like you. I feel like this person has tried to replace you. This person has tried to find other people who bring the similar energy that you do. And they haven't been able to find that. They haven't been able to find anyone like you we have ten, twin flame and we have loss i'm not really going to say this is a twin flame situation it may be but this person feels a loss by trying to replace you trying to find your energy in other people the same intensity this person feels like they lost out on the on authenticity of you you know you're an authentic person you are very genuine you bring something to the table that no one else can Gemini you're a unicorn they're not gonna find anyone like you um, emotional and physical abuse I need to speak my mind I'm going through transformation and changes and one last one Turn my world upside down. Wow, Gemini. <laughs> you turn this person's world upside down. And I feel like this person really has a need to come forward to speak with you. But I feel like they really don't know how. I feel like this person is really needing to make changes. I'm not sure if they're currently going through changes. But I, I feel like this person is really needing to make changes. And... They're will, they, they have to be willing to put their guard down. And I feel like this person's guards are very up at the moment because they feel like they're losing something by taking advantage of your situation. Um, I feel like that's the reason why they put you into the friend zone. They put you in the friend zone basically so they can save you for later, so th that you're not going anywhere. And they want to keep you safe and secure so that if they feel the need to double back when they feel ready so that they can double back when they're able to and you still be there and i feel like this person was very unfair at thinking like that this person was very selfish to think that you would stay in a situation that unhealthy to not have your needs met 
we have laughing and playing and I need to do things alone okay Gemini I feel like this person there's been some sort of disconnection with this person there could be a lot less contact than how it used to be because I feel like this person misses your playful nature they missing they're missing being able to talk to you being able to laugh and joke and play and I feel like this person was able to open up to you in a way that they weren't able to open up to anyone else and right now this person feels the need I, I feel like they they're spending a lot of alone time whether they're in a connection or not I feel like they're spending a lot of alone time um, to try to think things through I feel like that's what this person does they totally go into hermit mode in order to make decisions at first it upset me but now I know it's for the best yeah and I feel like this person this person feels like ending things was the best option because they know that they can't be what you need at the moment but they're going through a lot of con contemplation and this person is going through a lot of pain and a lot of heart heartbreak at the moment I feel a lot of stress and a lot of confusion when it comes to this energy um, this person is trying to figure out how or why your connection has come into their life we have a lot of cards coming out run away I know I hurt you pain yeah this person is going through a lot of pain I'm sorry I have issues from my past relationships definitely um, and I feel like this person this person is going through a lot at the moment whether you know it or not and they feel very bad for whatever they they did to you and I feel like they're having a hard time coming forward to start a conversation because this person is afraid of wearing their emotions on their sleeve they're afraid of feeling vulnerable they're afraid of feeling weak because this person has been in situations in the past that have been very overwhelming and have totally devoured their heart right that's what I'm getting and that is very intense but I feel like this person has gone through a lot of pain and heartbreak in the past this person the this pain may go all the way back to childhood to where this person wasn't taught how to fully show their emotions they weren't taught how to participate in a healthy relationship maybe they never had any good role models in their life that showed how a healthy relationship was supposed to be I feel like there's been a lot of cheating there's been a lot of fighting there's been a lot of arguing in this person's past one more card we belong together oh and so alone this person knows that they want to be with you they know that you they know that you have their heart and this person feels very alone without you and I feel like they're kind of drifting into this solitude drifting into this hermit mode to try to figure things out on a deeper level because the intensity of your connection the the beautiful connection that you have with this person or that you had with this person at one time they truly miss they truly see themselves being with you in some kind of future but they they want to keep you on hold they wanna they want to keep you safe because they're putting a lid on their emotions right now which is very interesting they don't want their emotions to show at all so this person may come across to you as very nonchalant very unbothered you know um 
having the best time of their life at the moment but truly this person is very sad very emotional and feels very unstable without you and their energy that's very interesting Gemini that's what I have for you I hope this helps many blessings to you love and light